We're broadcasting live from Music City at Newsom Stadium. The moon is full and the fans are ready for a howling good time. The Lycans love carnage, so this should be a good one. Hey, Grim, what do werewolves love that vampires hate? Now, that would be steaks, Bricks. Wow, I can't believe you know it. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the MFL. The team storm the field. The Cleveland Burns take on the Nashville Lycans. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hello once again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Huh? Hey, how'd your checkup go? Well, good news, bad news. Doc says I passed my physical. Oh, that's good. But I flunked my model. Not too good. Well, I, it's 50-50. Better odds than I get in Vegas. Get a point. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? And it's first and ten. <laughs> mutant trap and dies. Reminds me of my breakfast cereal, the old nut crunch. And it's first and ten. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. Second down and ten. Interception, and that's how you stop an offense. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like... Ah, that's not fair. Someone should call a penalty on this ref. Yeah, the death penalty. Hang them by the nuts. And that'll bring up second. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And that'll bring up second and one. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. And they line up.
up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He sits up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. And then to first down from a great catch. Was it a catch? Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed anyone who came to Mexico forever to crack their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they're not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? And it's first and ten. And he was stuck to him like glue. Second down and ten. With a burst of speed, he finds an opening and the first down. First down and one. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. He refuses to go down. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? And it's first and ten. is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. And he scores. No silver bullets gonna break. If you think you're dancing is bad, you should have been here in the old days. They used to mark their territory the old-fashioned way. But they agreed to dial it down to uh, interpretive dance. I took an interpretive dance class with a werewolf on Grim. before the class even started. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. And then, my friends, is why the world hates kickers. I kind of feel sorry for him. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Oh, what a 
punishing him that one. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Second down in a very lot. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Third down and three. Hit the quarterback goes down. <laughs> Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. And he snags the punt and looks. Ouch! What is this? Andy's wrestling? First and ten. And that pass is good for about five yards. Second down and five. First down and six. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. First down and six. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the change his court, did it? How good can it be? And that'll bring up second and one. Second down and a lot. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Oh, and the ref just bought himself one more play of life with some moves that would put some of our Hall of Famers to shame. Oh, good. That gives me time to get odds on him. Someone give me a phone. Second down and, and the offense jumps on sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Bam! Oh, man, that's the end of his day. He might want to try hurling those traps next time. Third down and forever. They call it a warp speed dirty trick. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. The punter for today is being played by my kid's sister. He just let that one drop and played safe, and the defense says we'll take it. And 
and it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that, Grim. Oh, boy. And it's first and ten. Second down and five. so hard I went into a dark tunnel thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light turns out it was just the visitors tunnel that he knocked me into and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face apparently the punter for the day is being played by my kids they let the pun drop and it will be down by the defense Second down and ten. And he picks up eight yards on a strong run. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. Third and two. I personally think that the ginormous guy is compensating for something, but I won't be the one to tell him. He could go all the way! And the defense is on his heels! The 20! Oh, sure, now he catches it! I hit Oh, mama! Just call him Cap and Crunch! Another one bites the dust! <laughs> the offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, Grim. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. First down and three. And that's a run for no gain. Second and three. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. They're gaining on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. They got a soft up right on this asshole. The 10. And he recovers the fumble. He runs it back for a defensive score. That's a backbreaker for the offense. You want to get some fun on your turn. The offense lost their final running back. Lucky for them, they're on defense now. Yeah, lucky to survive so much bad luck, carnage, and death, Grim. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? And he misses that extra point. Oh, well, look at clown shoes down there. Is he wearing actual clown shoes? I think so. That's probably why he missed. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. He's not going down. And it's first and ten. The defender says, I don't think so. 
ref that just called that penalty? He was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings. That sounds like a good job. He's right at home here taking money from coaches, players, and fans. I even saw him swipe the money from the bathroom attendant. Yeah, who don't do that? And it's first and ten. <laughs> I'm running out of excuses for this QB. You just, you just throw it to the guy. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? And he's off to the races. The 30. He's at the 20. Ouch, that's got to hurt. Man, those mutant traps will kill you faster than one of them. Holy crap. He missed time the spikes and ends up dead. Life is full of misery, Grim. Loneliness, suffering, and then it's over much too soon. First and ten. And that's a catch for three yards. Second down and seven. You can tell he's a berserker because he's frothing at the mouth. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. It sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more reception. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Hey, man, I scared a little chill out. I am a hell of a fellow. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback calls a sonic blast dirty trick. And then it's a first down from a... was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Oh, with the punishing hit. First down and one. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Actually, he does have some turkey skin wrapped on his backside from that bad burn he had last year. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Oh, with the brain. Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. First down! I 
seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw. They stump the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. And with another pick, the QB says, I can punch his way out. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I'm off. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? And it's first and ten. struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, throw in the half. Can you pick me up a soylent beer? The teams come out of halftime all tied up and ready to battle it out. Oh, jeez, Grim. I hope someone unties them soon. They gotta play football. <laughs> The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> nice pickup for six yards. Second down and four. One potato, two potato, three potato, four. The defense just... Blew. The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! And it's first and ten. He broke free and has open field in front of him. He's at the ten. He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Ah, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids aren't going to think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, <laughs> I don't want kids to think I'm cool. And they line up for the extra point. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Forfeit. 
You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. The ten. Holy mother of mutant mayhem. He scored. This should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> you have got to be kidding me. My sister could have made that kick. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. A big time hit. You ever been hit like that before, Britt? And the ref just called a bullshit penalty. <laughs> First and goal. The defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message. Because the messenger killed. You've got to avoid those spikes or you'll be a mutant pincushion. I was a chubby kid, Grim. My parents sent me to fat camp. My big brother told me as soon as he get there, stab the first kid you see and no one will mess with you. So I get off the bus at the camp, some kid runs up to me and stabs me. And it's first and ten. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Second down and ten. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutiny. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And it's first and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in school. Oh, he just got popped big time. Oh, my God. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. The offense lost their last quarterback. Next time their offense comes out on the field, they will have to forfeit the game. 
First down in a mile. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. Second down and ten.